Welcome everyone! In this video, I'll show you how to use the free Mozobook app, which you can download on both Android and iOS devices. You can find the app for your Android device in the Play Store, or download it from the App Store for your iOS device. You can now use the Mozobook app to download any textbook or workbook in the system free of charge. Look for the publications on the shelf, or search for the book by title. When you found the book you need, simply click on the Download button. Don't tick on the Download Interactive Content for Offline Use option. Just download the book for now to save storage space on your device. Later, you can download all the interactive content one item at a time. Click on Download to start downloading the book. And there you have it. Let's open it. Just thumb through the pages or open the table of contents for the topics that interest you most. Click on one of the topics to jump to the right page. You can also find a list of all the interactive content, including 3D scenes, videos, and audio recordings. Click on the pencil icon to take notes. There are various colors to choose from. You can also use the highlighter to mark the most important parts. Enter a keyword in the search field to find what you'd like anywhere in the book. Go on the next result or see all the results on a list. If you click on one of them, the book will automatically jump to the page you want. Notice the small icons in the margins of the pages. They indicate interactive content. For example, a 3D scene, a video, or an audio recording. If these icons appear gray, that means that you have to download the interactive content before you can open it. Now, I'll download a 3D scene about European honeybees. Rotate the 3D scenes, switch the labels on and off, and learn much more in the information bars. Switch between various views. If you want to open related interactive content, click on the chain icon. Related content includes 3D scenes or even videos. Open them to delve more and more deeply into a particular topic. Besides books, you can find a media library in the app which allows you to see all the interactive content available on MozaWeb. You can list them by type, for example 3D scenes, videos, or digital lessons. The digital lessons are among the most interesting elements in the media library. Let's choose one. Every digital lesson always starts with thought-provoking questions or statements. For example, what global environmental problems does humanity face? While discussing the topic, you can watch videos, do exercises in groups, or even open 3D scenes. The app contains tools as well. There are tools for various age groups, which provides students the chance to practice and improve on what they know. For example, let's see the Musical Instruments tool. With this tool, you can see a picture of an instrument and listen to the sound it makes. You can also generate worksheets based on the information included with the tool. You can choose the type of exercise and the number of questions as well. Another similar tool 
is the multiplication table. You can use it to teach students multiplication and division. Students can do fun exercises based on what they've learned. Download our app and try it yourself. With its wide range of options, it's certainly worth it. Thank you for your attention. I recommend everyone watch our tutorial videos to learn about MozaBook and MozaWeb. If you need further information, please go to our website at mozaweb.com and scroll down to the page to find the Can We Help You menu item. Click on it and write to us at our customer support page.